against Kendall defensively, obviously Caitlin's Caitlin, but what makes Iowa so difficult to defend? I think her ability to not just score, but only like facilitate for her teammates. And I think, you know, I think she did a good job of that today because I think Dallin Gretchen did a really good job of just kind of uh, like limiting her and like making her take contested shots. There were a couple she got free on, but I mean, she's Caitlin, so she's going to. But, you know, I thought Dallin Gretsch did a great job um, of that, but we just got to make sure the other guys, so like we're, when we're not on her, like we've got to rotate out and we've got to help them a little bit. So I think it was just they had us in rotation and Kate was able to facilitate. The open corner, obviously, did you guys, it's just so hard to prepare for an environment like that when you guys get the next yeah. get the hours. You've been in that environment before, just, but a lot of people on the floor maybe had one. Yeah, it was a little hectic at first, I think. Um, I mean, I've obviously played here before. We played at Indiana a lot, so like I was prepared. But it was just it's sometimes when the game gets going like that fast and they want they want to speed us up and it gets loud, you're sped up, and you can't hear what your coach is saying. So I think it got a little hectic, but I think we were able to kind of settle down in the second half. You know, we haven't seen you been on this for a while. What is the message to your teammates now that the one ball is finally down? You guys want to roll. What is the message to keep going just as we shoot? How would you go to the middle of yeah, I mean, they're a good team. I mean, they're, I think, number two in the country right now. So, I mean, we played them. I mean, we had some mistakes, and that's fine. But, you know, we played them to 13, 15, whatever the final score was. So, it's. I mean, we did our best. We didn't give up. And I think that's the key thing. I mean, there's been some games this season where we've just kind of rolled over um, when teams kind of throw a punch at us. But I thought we kept punching. We kept doing it. You know, we were telling We were very together. And I think we've got to stay together. And, you know, on the court, everyone's, you know, whoever's guarding Caitlin, we're like, you're good. Like, she's going to score. Like, next play. And you know, telling each other what we need to do. So it was, it, there was good communication between us and we just got to keep that going going through. So you guys got within 11 and it felt like you were right on the cusp of that. Like what, what yeah. makes it so difficult to kind of take that one more punch and yeah. get over the hump? It's right? just, we dig ourselves a hole so early and like, you know, there's been games where we've made the other teams dig themselves a hole. And so it's, and it's hard for them to come back. So just, I think like that start just killed us. And then you're having to push extra hard and call your way back like in the third and fourth when when they're trying to make sure like you're finished so I think it's just the timing of it all we just got to have I think better starts. Well, you've been here before but like what did you make of Clarkville and kind of what this has turned into? Uh, I think it's really cool for women's basketball you know I think um, it, it's cool to see a program have the kind of like love from fans and like little kids so I think it's great for the sport and it's it's, it's cool to have you know a player be able to bring that um, on herself so I think it's pretty cool.